What's up guys? Tony Regan here and today I'm throwing down making a cool dinner. I'm taking a classic and putting a spicy twist on it. We're gonna make some sriracha chicken alfredo and you know exactly what this is don't you? That's right. This is awesome. So let's just go and get started and jump right into this one. Now, you guys know, if I'm making this dinner, it's two things, simple and great. But before we jump into that, I know you're admiring this sweet, sweet t-shirt. You want one of these? I'll tell you how to grab one. These are for patrons of $5 or more. So go ahead, check out my Patreon. It totally helps me keep all this great content coming out. And like I said, if you're a patron of $5 or more, you'll get this awesome t-shirt. But now with that done, I'm gonna jump into the recipe. Go ahead and start by boiling water, dropping your fettuccine noodles in. You know how to cook noodles. It's the basic directions on the box. Now once that's done, we're ready to move on. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and cube my chicken into small bite-sized chunks. Now once I've got it chopped down, I'm gonna take my sriracha. Now you can control how much heat you want in this by using a little less or a little more sriracha. We like ours nice and spicy in this house, so I'm using four tablespoons. But like I said, go ahead and adjust it up or down. Then I'm gonna take some salt and pepper and mix that all together. Now I'm gonna let it sit. Go ahead and let these flavors absorb in and set it aside. I'm gonna take a little bit of oil, start heating that up, and as it heats up, I'm gonna start dicing up my garlic. Now after I was done mincing that up, I went I dropped it into the heated oil, I let it go for about a minute. It got nice and fragrant. I'm gonna go ahead and add my chicken in now. Now after about five minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and add my cream in, and I'll let that go. Uh, bring it to a boil, let it go for three or four minutes, letting it get a little bit thicker. Now, after a few minutes, I'm gonna go ahead and take my cooked pasta, get that put in there, get it nice and coated. And then once the pasta is nice and coated, I'm gonna go ahead and add in my Parmesan, my parsley, mix that all together and let it get melted down and this one will be done. So 20 minutes in guys, we're done with this one. That's all it took to make a great little family dinner and take a look at how it came out. It looks awesome. Awesome. I mean, this is a great looking dinner that's easy to adjust that spice up or down depending on how your family likes it. But you know what? I can't just look at this one. I gotta dig in and just give this one a try. This is freaking incredible. You guys are gonna love this one. So go ahead, like, share, comment on the video down below. Go ahead, if you need complete step-by-step -step printable instructions, check out AverageGuyGourmet.com. Go over to my Patreon. Subscribe for even $1 and help this content keep coming out. Or $5 and get an awesome exclusive t-shirt. Go ahead and subscribe. Give this one a try. And we'll see you guys next time.